it's time for a paper project update. Hey everyone, it's Jason. I'm up here at the top of my tree fort outside the back of my yard, the house in the background. And I wanna start this update by thanking my new supporters. A huge thank you to Steven Silha and your partner, Gordon. Uh, really appreciate your support. You were our very first, my very first supporter. So thank you so much. Also a huge thank you to Kate Thompson. Uh, You're just a joy and a love and I just, I just, I just appreciate every moment we have together. Uh, another huge thanks to Derek, uh, Derek Schusselman. Uh, you're a new friend I've met at the village and I just really, um, I just connect so much with your energy. I just love your, your, you have this loving, compassionate, kind of sweet style and I really appreciate you. So thank you for your support. And of course I love your wife, Anne. She's amazing as well. Um, and then I have to say thank you to mom and dad, John and Esther Sears. Both of them have signed up as supporters for the project. So uh, thank you so much for your support. So what are you supporting? What am I doing? What's the paper project? Um, one way that I've tried to, to find to describe it is this, as paper is to social media, um, so the paper project is to community building. So what I'm trying to do is bring things back to a simpler way and a, and a more natural way of connecting, um, recognizing the technology that we have is awesome and fun, but sometimes it gets in the way of doing what we really want to do. So that's quite simply what the paper project is, but another way to describe it is it's a collaboration. It is an art project and it, uh, it is a community collaboration around creativity. So we're gonna be creating things and you ask, what are we creating and why are we creating it? And what's the message around the creation? And those are questions that are actually best answered by the community. So it's not me bringing those answers or trying to, to drive a certain direction. It really is about bringing people together. That is really a hard thing to do is bring people together. And when we do that in a safe place, uh, amazing things happen. So that is why there is a story I wanna tell you. It's just, um, there's a story happening right around, around Village. And that is going to be the main focus of the paper project for the next few months is Village. Uh, so all of you are a part of Village, have been in Village, so you know what I'm talking about, so I don't need to describe it. But what I can tell you in terms of the story is that it started, uh, it started with a small group of people that kind of know each other. Uh, a lot of people that I knew that I invited to, to come in together to create a community, to create um, something that was meaningful to all of us. And um, as we move forward, we invited new people into that community. So everybody has been just inviting different friends and, and people that they meet into the into the village and amazing things have been happening. It's just really remarkable what happens when you create a safe place. For one, we have conversations that are really difficult to have um, outside of these safe spaces. So people have been sharing things that have happened to them in their lives that they have kept secret, that they want to let out, that they want other people to know about. And that's happened in the village in a, in a private safe space. Uh, the other thing that's happened is we've rallied around each other. Um, some people have had major problems in their lives and we've been able to surround them and, and, and comfort them and help them. And then, you know, the third thing that's happened in Village is that we are supporting other organizations. We've gotten some nonprofits involved and, and we're getting involved as volunteers and as financial supporters for the nonprofits. So I just want to keep helping grow this. I want to keep, I want this to be a bigger thing and get more people involved. And so that is going to be the main focus of the paper project for the next couple of months. And that is what your support is doing. And specifically what you're doing in supporting me is helping me with the administration of it. So in addition to some of the costs that are in the back end in terms of the database and sending the emails and everything, there is a little bit of work involved in keeping the administration organized, you know, just uh, sending the emails out. We have a lot of visitors. I want to be able to follow up with all the visitors and say thank you for coming and invite them to become members. I want to collect feedback from people. Um, sometimes people are going through hard times. I want to pay attention to that and make sure that we see that and, and that they're seen. And uh, that just requires someone who's there every single time that, that, that is just doing that, that role and uh, doing it with love. And um, that's the energy that I'm bringing to Village and that's the role that I wanna play there. So um, your support is helping me get there. So before I wrap up, I wanna just let you know about something that's coming up. So coming up, we're gonna have a paper project Village. It's a special uh, gathering. It's gonna be once a month and it's just going to be for the paper project supporters. It's a chance for you, you to meet each other, which I really want you to do. 
It's gonna be very, very short, just half an hour. And it's just a quick update on, on the project. And then at that time, I'm going to be sharing a little bit more about what the plans are in the future. Um, Cause I, I have some ideas about what direction we're going, but I think that it's best captured in the idea of village and growing village and what is possible when we as a community are collaborating to create things. It's just an absolutely amazing thing. So again, thank you from the bottom of my heart for your support. Please continue your support. I, I'm only asking for $10 a month for very intentional reasons. And um, there might be more opportunities next year uh, for greater support as I am transitioning out of a full-time job and trying to, to make this my full-time job. Um, so I'm looking for feedback. I'm looking for your support. And uh, I just appreciate and love all of you. So stay tuned for the Paper Project Village, uh, which will be happening relatively soon. And um, stay tuned for another update next month. All right, thank you so much for your support.